Coach Jacoby, your final plays in the LSU Tigers recovering a fumble and mm-hmm. ending a very dramatic game. How did it feel whenever you came with the ball? Uh, man, I'm I'm lost for words for that moment. Uh, I guess that's a that's a way to end a uh, career at a, a at a place. Um, I mean, all I can think about now is just all the things that you know I experienced here for four years, and um, I mean, you're never gonna get those moments back. So, I mean, I guess to go out, <laughs> like to go out that way, I mean, it, it's really special. Jacoby, you've seen a lot of great receivers. You played alongside, you know, Jamar and Justin and Terrace. How do you? What was it like watching Kason do what he did tonight? Man, it's. I mean, I mean watching him do. Uh, hold on, I'm let he, he'll let him leave. He, I'm not going to talk good in front of him. Uh, but uh, he's a special receiver, man, and um, he just got the sky's, the sky's the limit for him. And. Um, I, like I told him after the game, just uh, get his body right, and he's going to have a hell of a uh, hell of a career ahead of him. Jacoby, I mean, it, you know, some people have said that you've really taken on even more of a leadership role these last few weeks as the mm-hmm. season's end. I guess just kind of what have you tried to do in this pretty wild season? To, and what have you seen from that locker room to kind of mm-hmm. get where you are right now? Um, I. I uh, this season was just full of lessons. Uh, I mean, for me, it, um, it it made me mature. Um, like I said at the beginning of the season, that um, I'm a sore loser, and when things weren't going right, um, I got out of character. Um, just because losing just doesn't sit right with me. And and when things uh, uh, for me, I just basically just got one with God and just asked Him for uh, guidance and patience, and um, He blessed me with that. And I was able to move forward um, with, through the season and, and just make the most of the uh, finish in the season. Hey, Jacoby, you know, you guys as a defense were able to force, you know, six pretty key turnovers tonight, able to capitalize, I think, with points on most of them. I guess mm-hmm. talk a little bit about the game plan heading in uh, on Matt Corral and just kind of how you guys were able to attack it from. Well, the thing was, we, we knew he was going to give the ball to us. Um, we just had to trust our trust the game plan. Uh, and when plays were there to be made, we had to make them. Um, but uh, the, the six turnovers are outstanding. I mean, it just shows you uh, the talent of this defense. I know we gave up some stuff towards the end, but uh, like uh, Jabril said earlier, that we have a lot of young guys here. And to keep fighting and keep their head on straight um, through the ups and downs of this game shows a lot of maturity. I mean, they, have, they, have, they really have to grow up fast this season. And um, just like that question, uh, I, feel, I feel like the program is moving upward um, just because all the young guys are really maturing and, um, you know, they, they have a lot of great talent. Okay, we'll do uh, one last question. Cobble. Hey, man, um, 2020 is been a crazy year for you, I guess. Just what mm-hmm. would you remember out of, out of this whole time? Uh, I, I mean, just sticking together. Uh, just uh, grit and having fight, uh, having some fight about us, and you know, um, you know, one of the things that we talked about with Coach O and talking about with Jack is that you're you're always going to remember this. I mean, shoot, when you know the ball starts rolling, my career is uh, done. Um, you know, I'm 50 years old with kids. <laughs> I can always point back to tell them, hey, I didn't quit, and you don't have an excuse to quit. I mean, I mean, the the tables and, and people were quitting left and right, and um, you know, just all the guys just stayed in and fought. Uh, you know, th- those are the memories that you're always going to uh, have with you. And you're going to take to the grave with you. And, uh, you know, it, it was pretty special. Thank you, Jacoby. Mm-hmm. Sure. Yes, sir. We'll wrap up with Max Johnson.